stay my blade from the flesh of the innocent. Hide in plain sight. Never compromise the Assassin Brotherhood. These are the tenets of the Creed. The principles I used to live by. I was a young man then. The Seven Years' War was about to begin. I could not have imagined what the future had in store for me. Nor the cost I would choose to bear. My name is Shay Patrick Cormac. This is my story. <sighs> can't just well can't say that either I'll well, say it after this won't lack for firewood at least <laughs> admit it I nearly had you <laughs> nearly counts for nothing Shay. and besides no that was just luck I make my own luck Liam Ah, you've been saying that for years, but you're precious little to show for it. Or have you been spending it all getting out of trouble? Well, you know, trouble just follows me around. Let's head back. They tricked Come me. Come on. Captain Deliver André and his crew must have run into some trouble. Who knew meeting with smugglers would lead to no good? I mean, Edward killed. I still don't understand why you can't tell me what we're doing here. Because Chevalier decided not to tell you. I thought we were friends, Liam. We are. But this is business. It doesn't concern you, Shay. Edward killed one, but that was a little different. He was just a pirate. And he also killed a traitor. Fast for you. I'm just keeping an eye on you, in case you fall down and hurt yourself. Let's not keep Chevalier waiting. I'm so sick, Rita. This space, that place. Where the hell were you two? We were out hunting. What happened here? My men were attacked by some English sea dogs. Why, Captain Joseph, couldn't you fight them all off by yourself like you're always saying? It is Captain Louis Joseph Gauthier, Chevalier de la Verandrie. And you are dreaming if you think any training could make you into a proper assassin. Do you even know what that means? It means being responsible for an ancient and proud tradition. It means obeying your mentor without question. How else will we ensure freedom for the human race? That's pretty words, Chevalier. But I don't feel too free at the moment. Well then, feel educated! I will teach you some manners, boy. <laughs> You irresponsible wretch. No wonder they got attacked. You simpleton. You rot brain cabbage farmer. Gentlemen, stop. We got a common enemy, and I reckon he's close. The Royal Navy attack my vessel and force my men to flee. We are stranded, and what is worse, the smugglers we were supposed to meet have been taken prisoner. Shay and I are free, those smugglers. You, treat your wounded. Take these. You'll need them. Tread with care, Shay. The Royal Navy be ready for us. Remember your training. Kill them all and remain undetected. Where are 
So one before I bash out your brains. Keep an eye out, lads. Their pals are still out there somewhere. There he goes again. There are two more. Three more. He's walking my way. I should be able to assassinate from the back. Oh no, there are more. He's gonna be upset when he comes back to camp. Unfortunately, he never made it. I will go over there once I get this chest. Ooh! You gonna come get me? Oh! Why do they decide to move? Every time I move. Don't be finished with that cannon. Saving those fellas for you. Very thoughtful. Maybe you were not completely useless, Shade. I'm thinking of useless. Those blockheads won't be needing this vessel anymore. This pile of mail. You want her, Shay? She is yours. Now bring me back to my ship. You heard, Chevalier? This vessel is yours, Shay. Go on. Take the wheel. Some of the men you rescued agreed to join us. They should prove a good crew. I'm not so certain about their captain, but next to me you are the most experienced sailor in the Brotherhood chain. Besides, we could use another vessel. Even this pitiful one. She's mine, ain't she? My own ship. Your own pile of garbage, yes? Ah, with a lick of paint and a few new cannons, she'll look as fine as anything on the Seven Seas. Shall we begin, Captain? Indeed, mate. Oh, God, no. She's a mess. But she's still afloat. And her name's the Morgan. Morgan? That silly fairy queen who ruined Merlin, the wise? Oh, she's perfect for you, she Margot's an old goddess. The queen of war and darkness. She harps the souls of fallen warriors. Perfect indeed. We've already ruined most of my shit. At least a third. A ship. Ship. They will sink her! Let's put the bar into the test, Captain Shay. Ready for battle, man! I 
feel like I missed a whole ship. And I missed again. lads chevalier is pleased with us what course would you have me set shay time to report back to the mentor wouldn't you agree wise words captain wise words you do it's some kind of dormant virus Emergency. shit hang on i'm getting you out of there sorry for the rough exit your piece working check you were just an anonymous animus yes you were using it to access a genetic memory file in helix labeled shay cormac you work for Abstergo Entertainment, remember? Any of this ringing a bell? Your session triggered something bad, and it's affecting the whole building. We need to find your boss. You haven't forgotten your boss, have you? Melanie LeMay, zipper, chipper, overachiever? Here, take your communicator, check it if you get lost. Now let's get out of here. Follow me. Double time. This chaos on, is absolutely your fault, in case you're wondering. Everything is gonna be okay, guys. Stay what did I do? What the hell is happening? A file labeled Shay Cormac was booby-trapped with some kind of virus. Your job is to prevent things like this. We need to contain these genetic memories, then we can destroy them. No. Isolate them. I want to study these memories. But... With respect, Miss LeMay, this is not a request. You heard the man. Fine. I need to borrow your numbskull. That okay with you, Ms. LeMay? Hey there, this might seem a bit weird, but you're gonna work for contractors we hired to, you know, upgrade our security. Mr. Otto Berg and Ms. Violet DaCosta. Call me Violet. I have to go check on our people and prepare a statement for the press. Do whatever they tell you to do, okay? Go team! Technically, you're not responsible for this, but you're the one who let the virus out. So I think it's only fair you help me clean it up. Mr. Berg wants us to relive Shay's genetic memories. To do that, we need to access them from Helix. But the Helix is down. We'll have to reboot the main servers in the basement. Man, whoever designed this virus is a genius. Did you just leave there? How much do these pads cost? To Robert Fraser, CC People. Subject Arno Dorian. Hi, Robert. You come highly recommended, and I'm thrilled to have you in our studio. I'm putting you to work on a special project for me. Your project is Arno Dorian. His story takes place during the French Revolution. I want you to explore every avenue of his life that you can. The goal is to have a new blockbuster to present to the Abstergo Brass next year. As such, this is super classified. So they just left a super classified tablet on the floor. Your director supervisor will be Aiden St. Clair. You can only discuss the project with Aiden or myself. As you'll probably be logging 
some overtime in your animus. I've added a mandatory re weekly meeting with your psychiatrist, Dr. Bibo, also CC, to make sure you're not suffering from any bleeding effect. Welcome to Abstergo Entertainment. Don't let me down. It seems like every time there's like a a new story they add in a new person, they don't actually have employees. There's a working area server on this floor. I guess it'll have to do for now. I think that's all Tyre. I want regular updates on your progress with Shay's genetic memories. Why? He's just a nobody as far as I can tell. If Shay Cormac is who I suspect he is, then this temporary setback may provide us with an unexpected reward. Proceed to the server room on this floor. I can't go there, so... figure out how to um okay that's what I needed good job this core wasn't too complex but rebooting the advanced hardware in the rest of the building will require more work the assassins would have you believe that Al Mualim was a great mentor who became corrupted with greed and that he schemed with the Templars to acquire an apple of Eden I see instead a shrewd and cunning leader. A man who used his best assassin, Altair ibn Lahad, to eliminate his conspirators in order to keep the apple for himself, so that he could use it to enforce world peace. While it must be stated unequivocally that Al Mualim was not a Templar, it is interesting to me that his vision of peace was more in line with Templar philosophy than assassin. In the past, both sides had the same goal of peace. Our only difference was how we chose to achieve it. Had Al Mualim not been killed by Altair and allowed to carry out his plan, perhaps we would not be fighting now. It was only after Altair reformed the Brotherhood with its new ideals of free will that the conflict truly escalated and spread across the planet. For if the so-called wise man of the mountain can see things from our point of view, Surely the same can be said for other assassins. It has been a long time. Achilles. Adewale. How go things in the West Indies? Very poorly, I'm afraid. Your countenance tells me we should discuss this. Come. Who's our visitor? That's Adewale. He's a slave who freed himself. And hundreds of his brothers in the West Indies. That man's a living incarnation of the Creed. I see. You join me for some practice? Soon. I've got uh, other business first. Tell me what happened, old friend. It was terrible, Achilles. The ground shook, and the ocean waves crashed over Port-au-Prince. 
How many were lost? Aren't Thousands. you supposed to be training? No family was left untouched. I hate to bring up practical matters at a time like this. But did Mackendall's man complete his task before the earthquake hit? I cannot know. Von Redi has not been found. He was a strong maroon, one of Mackendall's best students. Such a shame. So we cannot know if he found the site. Indeed. But if there was a temple under the waves, I doubt it is still standing. And the artifacts that showed the way? Stolen. The Templars broke in during the chaos. They seized the manuscript and precursor box. I gave chase on the sea, but lost their trail when they reached New York. We must consider what to do next. You are late. Oh, what did I miss? Only the first hour of training. We're always training, Kasegawase. And we'll continue to do so. Do not waste your words. Shea abhors improvement as much as cats abhor leashes. Hey. A pity. The boy has so much potential. But so little discipline. All right. All right. What would you have me do? Well played. So far... Liam is the only one who's actually nice to Shay. So, what's the challenge today? Shooting straight and true. Here, you can use these. These are yours. Well, I want you to have half a chance of succeeding. Go on. Shoot these targets. You can take your time. Not too much. More work after this. Reload. Anyone can hear targets standing still. Let's see how you do on the run. Okay, let me reload. Come on, hurry up. I feel like I'm supposed to be in the tree. And one more. I got 15 seconds. Come on. Hurry up. Well done, Shay. Keep it up. You're doing all right, Shay. Don't let the others vex you. They mean well, but they'll never show it. It's about time you showed up. Far be it for me to keep a lady waiting. I'm no lady here. Don't you forget it. I'm your teacher. And you're better. Well, some of that is true, at least. What should we be doing? Exploring a myriad ways to end a life. You two! Make yourselves useful and watch Shay. Remain undetected. Can you kill without being noticed? I don't think he's going to turn around. You certainly know how to handle yourself. Nicely done. I am surprised. Okay, I'm going to get this one again. I should be able to get both of these once he passes. Uh, yeah, he's not going to see. Oh, kill one while sprinting. Ah! You didn't see nothing. Did I not just kill from a bush?
top form shit. Surprise. Mm -hmm. You did better than I expected. Have your skills actually grown, Shay? <laughs> Do not get a swelled head over it. One more to go. Shay, follow me. It's time you learn to survive in the frontier. I think I've been managing well enough so far. Perhaps. But there is more I can teach you. Probably can't touch the ground. Time for the hunt. Oh, okay. That's easy. Use all your senses together to find prey. I think that's an elk. Yeah. to use what you have taken from nature. So I will be hunting animals. With these, you can keep your pistols close. Achilles has one more thing to show you. I was gonna go for the dummy again. Say, I hear you've become quite the marksman. Generous gift. Thank you, mentor. My ship awaits, Achilles. The people of Haiti will make good use of your supplies. I trust you will retrieve what has been lost. Lost? The Templars stole two precious artifacts. A manuscript of ancient wisdom and a box that allows one to understand its language. I have tracked the Templar as far as his coast, but I fear the rest is up to you, my friend. Farewell, Adiwale. Whoever controls the artifacts can access precursor sites of power. We must recover them, or none are safe. I didn't see that challenge. Where to? Whatever Templar affairs lead us. Liam, it's not like you to set out without a plan. Plan or no plan. We choose our own battlefield. And hey, we're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right you are. Let's set sail. Crowded all on! We only have one lead, Shay. I was about to go straight for land. What brings us closer to the artifacts? So Achilles tasked you with this mission? No. He tasked me to task you. you need to find what was stolen from Mackendall, Shay. You have to recover the precursor box of manuscript. This is your mission. And what's yours? <laughs> Watch your arse. Achilles doesn't really trust me, does he? Give it time, Shay. Do this for him. And for us. Do much more than earn his trust. Liam, 
Do you know what Achilles writes about? I see him in his office all the time, bent over his papers. He keeps records and accounts. Studies what little is known about the pieces of Eden. And of course, he corresponds with assassins on other continents. Liam, you could be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as you. I cannot help if Achilles wants me to be familiar with our counterparts in Europe and elsewhere. Said like his favorite son. Connor's his favorite and only son. Then Achilles is heir. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. You call me that again. I'll throw you in the ocean. That's all but mates! Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the ton in France. Ah, the cabbage farmer has returned. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'd be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it, imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our ally has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship. How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers, Shay. When the time comes, they will lend aid and help us fight the Templars. If only there was beef would realize the Templars were pulling their strings. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we're meeting? You need not worry about Le Chasseur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and English fleets. And he knows more about what goes on in these parts than you can ever hope to learn. So Liam, what could you tell me about Adewale? You obviously admire the man. I... I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who'd done so much for our cause. It's much more than that. Adewale was already a Lijan before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate. The scourge of the West Indies, rubbing elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Ruth Rogers, and Calico Jack Rackham. I think I actually should have read that because it's not working. Fire! There, Captain. An English vessel. And she looks to be in trouble. That's fine indeed. Perhaps we should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. And let's not be too hasty. She's full of crown cargo. Take a look for your spyglass and see for yourself. Could you sight? I say this is a good day to lighten King George's pockets. Be careful. A few shots should be enough to cripple her. Too much damage and she'll go down with all souls. It all spoils. We can board and lose. I didn't know I, I didn't know I was that low. And all spoils. We can board and loot her before the crew knows what to do. Captain, hold your fire! That's what I tried to do before. Show them what's Now's the time. Let's board her. Files are ours for the morning. I, I think I hit that fire trap. Should go down with all souls and all spoils. We can board. Yes. Now, let me try this again.
Uh, it's free money. I'll take it. Repairing probably doesn't cost that much. At the sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the Morgan before going any further. There's a harbor master stationed nearby. Spend our new wealth on improvements. Oh, I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes. Osama Kano is our mentor. He gathers many of his assassins from the Maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. A shame, though. They escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in that earthquake. But. Haiti's a French colony now. Oh, it is. And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French own the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Our struggle is beyond political borders, Shay. Anticosti shouldn't be far. Keep us on course, Captain. The French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. I don't know what I'd do if I saw a boat just drift very quickly in the port. Uh, well, run. Yeah, never mind. I know what I'd do. There it is. Articusti. The chasseur should be there. And with any luck, he will know where to find that manuscript. Darsol, but mates! Dock the ship here, Captain. We've arrived at Anticosti Island. Should get that viewpoint. So, how goes the first one? Take a look at this. I borrowed these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Shea Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you seek. It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings, plants, and animals out of an opium dream. Were there no charts? No, no, no maps? No. There may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the roast beefs could ken Where is the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington sent him. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay, let's return and find him. You, sir, have our thanks. I gotta kill George's brother. Lawrence Washington docks is ours. Liam, you're finally getting into the spirit of things. He's a temper and a politician. What's there to like? Good. Hoist anchor. Why does Chevalier get off ordering us around like that? We're assassins, same as him. He's more experienced and he knows these waters better, Shay. That makes him in charge in these parts. Well, he commands me around back at the homestead too. Is he a truffle pig to know land better than me? Show some respect, Shay. He ought to respect me, Liam. I stick my neck out as much as any of us. Yeah, twice as often, it seems. That's just the thing. Chevalier hangs back and thinks before making a decision. His experience has earned him that right. 
I wonder how much more experience I'll need before I can decide when to wake up or take action. I swear, Liam, sometimes I feel I was more grown up when we were children. We slept rough and... I kind of want him to finish. But at least we decided where and when. Oh, that's it? Where do I dock? Trying to think about the best way up there. I think I should be able to go from here. Templar's desire to understand the nature of these artifacts. Their spies have called upon many doctors and other learned people in the year. They have also approached many tribes with questions. Yeah, they've been showing that manuscript far and wide. No one can read the strange writing or understand the images. We do have a name, though. We learned that Lawrence Washington sent out the manuscript. Lawrence Washington. Businessman, Virginian politician, and high-ranking Templar. Why, uh, yes. I recently heard he was back from the West Indies. One of my men saw his major domo pick up a strange package. Then that package will be delivered to him promptly. Shay, figure out what it is and find Washington. And when you do, learn all you can. I'll prepare the Morrigan. Well, if we've any luck, that ship will lead us right to him. I make my own luck, Liam. And Washington is running out of his. Careful, Shay. These waters are full of enemies. Leave the top, Yeah. Yeah. There isn't really... I could maybe go left. They're turning real fast. Herring, get straight to left. Brief it on, Tonks. Incoming Don't ship. Say it. They're giving chase. Up, Bring it. Ship to the road. There it is. Burn on. Aye. There she is. All down. All right, man. Time to be quiet. Lawrence Washington is a powerful and businessman, be a slave owner, and a leading Templar. We lost track of him about a year ago. We recently learned he was in Barbados, but I haven't been able to confirm that. Now. Now you think he had something to do with the theft of the artifacts, don't you? We wouldn't have go a little further. Haiti's a short voyage from Barbados, and his return to the colony certainly coincides with the arrival of the artifacts. We cannot let the Templars get control of these colonies. Whatever happens. Lawrence Washington must not survive. We're clear. I'll make sure he does it. Oh, there's an island. Let's move. We are on the blockade, Captain. I just won't do. Shay, you must follow that ship on land. I'll do that. 
Bring the Morrigan around another way. Aye, Captain. Track There's that package. And find world. Washington. Short and sail. Get off the squad. Remember what I said. Washington must die. Gotcha. Need them to stop following. You'd think he'd learn. Do I need a hit shot? It's not what it looks like. I uh, guess he didn't see me then. No, I just want to. Yeah. I want that bullet back. I thought I was going to be able to just walk up there. Would have been much easier if I could. What's this? Air rifle. The air rifle is an efficient, silent, ranged weapon which can use sleep or berserk darts as well as grenades and firecrackers. You can purchase darts and grenades in general stores or craft them from your inventory. This is a strange surprise. Not quite what I was expecting. Now I must find Washington and interrogate him. Washington can barely stand on his own two feet. Better be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. Oh, y'all weren't supposed to see that. I need to find a bench or something.
I'm not moving the body. I'm glad he didn't fall down. Now, I need to kill him while he... I'm blended. Okay, right here. Where'd he get a new guard from? I don't think he's coming over here. Try to blend in real quick. What can I help with? What's wrong with him? He's not stopping, is he? He's he's smart. Okay. I know where I can go. Yeah. Yeah. You are too late, assassin. It's never too late to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <laughs> but my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here <coughs> has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you for making my end a quick one. And thank you for revealing your master plan, you scheming snake. Everybody knows what a smoke bomb does. God damn it. Better hurry. Liam, I hope you brought the ship around. Why? People keep tackling me. Is that a ship, Mortar? That's not Spartan. I mean, they're they're following me now. How big is this area? Lawrence Washington is dead. You look disappointed. The sickly way that man looked. He would have been dead in a month anyway. Two other Templars got away. They're looking into the manuscript and box. Did they have the artifacts? I don't know. Perhaps. I can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. Find the objects, Lee. Cheer up, Shane. It's a rare day we could sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak, it didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. <laughs> 